maybe those people in charge decided, yeah, we need some more money and we need to fund these things. And the U.S. government doesn't have any money, so we need to go to the people and take it from them instead. Yeah, that's that's exactly how my head's looking at this, right? Have you done your taxes yet? Right. I don't know about you, but I am actually getting a refund for the first time in years. I, I could not believe it. I was like, what? I'm getting a refund? Yeah. I, I uh, bought a Tesla last year and, and it was just enough, just enough to get us the tiniest of refunds. And I'm like, this is so cool. I've not had a refund in so long. I can't believe it. Right. The IRS, though is saying they're going to crack down on high income tax cheats owing hundreds of millions of dollars. Now, I know that's not you. I know you wouldn't be that kind of person, right? You're not going to be a tax cheat. No, ma'am. No, sir. The IRS is going after 25,000 people who earned more than a million dollars and 100,000 people with incomes between 400 and a million. The IRS has announced it's clamping down on more than 125,000 cases of high-income earners who failed to file federal income returns since 2017 with the aim of recouping hundreds of millions of dollars in unpaid taxes. That's convenient. I wonder what they could be using all these hundreds of millions of dollars in unpaid taxes for. I'm not a conspiracy theorist. Or am I? Because I love a good conspiracy. But we seem to be paying for a lot of things that are, I don't know, in other countries recently, right? We seem to be funding, oh, I don't know, different European countries who are waging, I'm not, I don't want to say the exact terms because I don't want YouTube flagging this. They're waging games with other countries uh, over their borders um, in the Middle East as well. And I don't know, maybe this, the the people in charge decided, um, yeah, we need some more money and we need to fund these things. And uh, that the, the U.S. government doesn't have any money, so we need to go to the people and take it from them instead. Yeah, that's that's exactly how my head's looking at this, right? Under this new non-filer initiative, the agency will start sending out non-compliance letters to 25,000 people who earn more than a million dollars in taxes and over 100,000 people with incomes between 400,000 and a million. In all the above cases, the IRS says it received third-party information, such as through W-2s and 1099s, indicating these people received more income but failed to file a tax return, right? Uh, the agency had limited resources to go after non-compliant earners in these tax brackets since 2016 due to severe staff and budget cuts. But, hey, didn't they just get 80,000 new IRS agents? Oh, awesome. Yeah, I wonder what they were going to use those for. And with the I I Inflation Reduction Act, the IRA, resources, the agency finally has the funding to identify non-filers. Finally. Well, I mean, they couldn't have run that computer program before this, right? At this time of year when millions of hardworking Americans are doing the right thing of paying their taxes, we cannot tolerate those with higher incomes failing to do their basic civil duty of filing a tax return. Give me a break. <laughs> yeah, enough said. I think we know who is uh, driving this right there, right? Let's take a look at what the AI trading data has to say about Intuit. Intuit, the uh, head company for TurboTax, right? We actually got a sell signal back on December 11th. So if you were a existing shareholder in Intuit, now may be the time to cash out those shares. Now may be that time. Uh, if you had been following these signals, right? You could have seen a signal return of 47 0.61%, which is pretty outstanding. So if you want to get your hands on some of these outstanding signals for one low price for lifetime access, and we're in the final weeks of this, head on over to ovtlyrdeal.com. You don't want to miss out on this, right? This is the one time we're ever going to offer it for a lifetime, and it will be ending soon. And you can get these kind of signals every single day. So be sure to head over to ovtlyrdeal.com while you can. Oh, yeah, here we go. Uh, thanks to my... Whenever I read these kind of tweets, right, that come from the president, thanks to my Inflation Reduction Act, get off my, get off my lawn, old man. The IRS is cracking down on 125,000 high income tax cheats who haven't filed their taxes since 2017. Hardworking Americans do the right thing and file every year. The wealthiest Americans ought to do the same. I don't know about you, but when I see this kind of stuff, it just grinds my gears, grinds my gears because this person, 
I think this person is probably uh, following that same boat. How much have you and your family paid in taxes for all the money you receive for selling access to your office? Your son's already charged with tax evasion for millions. While he tried to uh, expense a million dollars for escorts and drugs. Meanwhile, you're going after 250,000 hardworking Americans. Not, not only hardworking Americans, but their companies, right? A lot of these people's are, people are entrepreneurs and, um, you know, they provide the jobs. And by going after them, I'm pretty sure you're making things harder for not just them, but for those that, you know, trickle down from them. Is Hunter paying his fair share? Thanks to your inflation, prices are so unaffordable that most of us had to take a second job. Now, this is this is a great place to start. The Biden's total income before 2016. And then in the next few years, huh? What were they selling? I don't know. I'm, I'm just saying is what it is. Hunter Hunter is on that list, right? I'm sure he is. Yeah, for sure. You know what else is unbelievable? The YouTube algorithm continues to suggest videos. I don't know how it works, but it says that one of these two videos is going to be the best video for you to watch right now. So click one of those to watch more, and I'll see you on the next Outlier Live. Have a great day. Talk soon. <laughs>